Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Happy New Year to you all. Hallelujah. We love you so much and we wish you all the best for this new year. Hallelujah. God is on your side and victory, victory is yours today. Hallelujah. Amen. My name is Caesar. I want to welcome you to our channel this day. Hallelujah. We are here on Swangano Island. This is the land of my fathers. Hallelujah. Uh, and uh, we are surrounded by the Lake Victoria. Amen. Wow. What a sight. What a sight. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory be to God. And today, um, we are in the book of Matthew. Matthew chapter number 10. Hallelujah. From verse number 16 all the way to 42. Hallelujah. The Lord is still uh, instructing his disciples on how to carry out the great commission. Hallelujah. Amen. And uh, we are going to uh, pick up from where we left on the other video, on the, from the last video. Uh, praise the Lord. Amen. And in Matthew chapter 10 and verse number 16. Hallelujah. The Lord says to them, Hallelujah. I am sending you. I am sending you uh, as sheep among wolves. Hallelujah. Amen. You know, if a sheep is brought before wolves, uh, the wolves would tear it up. Hallelujah. In pieces. Hallelujah. And that is what the Lord is saying. I am sending you. Hallelujah. To a place where your life is not guaranteed. Your safety is at risk. Hallelujah. I am sending you a sheep among wolves. Hallelujah. Therefore, hallelujah, this is what you ought to do. Be wise. As serpents, hallelujah. You know how a snake is wise, be wise as serpents, and then again, gentle as doves, hallelujah. That is in Matthew chapter 10 and verse number 16. Be wise as serpents and gentle as doves because it is a hard place. When you go out to preach, it's never going to be easy. People will be waiting for you, and we know from, from the history of the gospel. How they were waiting for the uh, for the preachers of the gospel, for the evangelists. They were waiting for them, hallelujah, to stone them, to put them in prison, and to kill them. This is how, hallelujah, we preach. This is how the gospel is preached. This is what we do. Hallelujah. This is what we do. Amen. And this is how we do it. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. And then he goes on to tell them, hallelujah, in verse number 20, when they, uh, when they uh, hand you to prison, uh, into prison, when they throw you into prison and they hand you over to authorities, do not worry about what you will say, hallelujah, because the Lord, the Lord, the Holy Spirit, amen, he will give you the words to speak, that is in Matthew chapter 10 and verse 20, he will give you the words to speak in the name of Jesus, like he did to Stephen, you remember Stephen the, when they were about to stone him, hallelujah, in the book of Acts chapter 7, the Spirit gave him the words to speak in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, hallelujah, and then in verse number 27, the Lord says in Matthew chapter 10, in verse number 27, would you hear me tell you in secret, hallelujah, shout it aloud on rooftop, on rooftops and on top of mountains, hallelujah, and then in verse number 28, the Lord says, do not be afraid of man, hallelujah, who can only kill the body, but rather be afraid of the Lord, of our God, of our Father. We call him here in a, here in a, on, on our island, we call him Katonda, we call him Katonda, Soifu Katonda, God our Father, Soifu Katonda, that is his name, that is how we call him here, hallelujah, God our Father, I be afraid of him who is able to kill both the body. Hallelujah. Both the body and the soul. Who is able to destroy both the body and the soul in hell. Praise the Lord. Praise uh, the Lord in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. And then he goes on to say from verse number 33. Confess me before men. Do not be afraid to confess me. Do not be afraid to confess me before men. Because if you don't confess my faith, your faith in Christ, before men, the Lord will also not confess you before the Father in heaven. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. And then he goes on to say that he came to bring division. Hallelujah. He came to bring division. He came to bring war and the sword. Hallelujah. Jesus came to bring war and the sword because this world is full of the enemy.
enemy. This world is full of demonic uh, uh, dominance. Hallelujah. Amen. And he says, I came to bring warfare. I came to bring us word. Therefore, a man's enemy, hallelujah, a man's enemies will be the members of his household. There will be people who the devil will use, hallelujah, among your household, among your friends, who will want to pull you back, who will want you to give up your faith. And that is what the Lord will say, says, I came to set up a man, hallelujah, against his father, a daughter against her mother, hallelujah, a daughter-in-law against the mother-in-law, in the name of Jesus. This was in, rev in reference to the message of the gospel, hallelujah, in the name of uh, Jesus, hallelujah. And then he goes on to say, our Lord goes on to say, uh, from verse number 40, I believe verse number 40, hallelujah. Whoever receives, amen. You remember we're still uh, commissioning uh, the disciples, whoever receives this message, whoever receives you, hallelujah, in the name of a prophet, he will receive uh, the prophet's reward. Whoever gives you water in the name of a disciple, hallelujah, he will receive the reward, whoever receives you, hallelujah, in the name of a prophet, he will receive his reward. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. It's a reward for you. It's a reward for you when you give cold water, hallelujah, to those who are preaching the gospel. Hallelujah. You support them. God will reward you in the name of Jesus. But above all, above all, remember to open the door of your heart because there is no greater reward than that hallelujah for you hallelujah to be crowned hallelujah to be crowned to receive the crown hallelujah on the day of judgment praise the lord praise the lord i pray that uh matthew chapter 16 hallelujah from verse uh, matthew chapter 10 from verse 16 to all the way from verse 42 has been a blessing to you hallelujah as you go preaching amen remember it's not, it's not easy. Hallelujah. There will be people who want to put you back. People who want you uh, to, 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 uh, to say all things against you. Praise the Lord. Jesus had already mentioned this. So don't be discouraged. If you are a missionary, don't be discouraged. If you witness Christ as an evangelist in your neighborhood, in your town, this message is for you. Don't be discouraged. Just as the Lord says, are you not free from every city in Israel? Until the Son of Man comes, hallelujah, be encouraged, hallelujah, keep preaching, keep pushing, and then in the name of Jesus, and you shall receive your reward. This is a message for us, hallelujah, let us keep pushing, let us keep preaching, and the Lord will give us the victory. God bless you so much. If you haven't subscribed, kindly remember to subscribe, hallelujah, share this video with your friends, for this is a message for a new year. God is on our side. God will come through for us. God bless you. Bye-bye. I'll see you tomorrow. Amen.